tell you this, I was the last plane out of Bangor, Maine, right before the big blizzard, last plane out. I'll tell you this too, I was the last plane out of New Orleans, right before Katrina. Just recently, I was the last plane out of Tampa, right before Irma. So just so y'all know, I'm leaving here tomorrow. <laughs> How about newly married engaged folks? Anybody? Newly married engaged? Yeah? Newly married or engaged, sir? Been married a month. <laughs> What are you doing here? <laughs> Do not be fooled by the first year of marriage, okay? It'll trick you. Because the first year you're married, you're still basically the same people you are when you're dating, and that's fake. <laughs> year two on, it gets real. First year my wife and I are married, we go to bed together, she looks fantastic. Year two on, she looks like she's gonna race the Iditarod. Wears Uggs to bed. I haven't seen her feet in 18 years. You mark my words, sir, you're too on. You hear yourself saying stuff like, oh wow, new sweats. I love gray. Yeah, put the hood on, go to the bed with the Unabomber. Yeah, come on. I'm a comedian who's a Christian. I've never built myself as a Christian comedian because uh, Christian comedians aren't funny. <laughs> I'm, that's a joke. <laughs> yeah, sorry, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> my whole thing is, my approach is, if, if I strayed away from how this started, because God and I, not that God, you can make a deal with God, but I did. I just said, hey, uh, you know, if this thing works out, I will do my best to honor you and all I do. So I think that's why uh, it's been successful, because I try not to stray too far away from that.